We're at the shops of Highland Park Village on the east side of Oakline Avenue, just south of Armstrong Parkway at Wycliffe Avenue. We're here to visit with John Alexis of TJ Seafood. John, how are you today? Fine, thanks. How are you doing? I'm doing good, thank you. Every day you wake up and you get to eat fresh seafood, it's a good day. Well, that, now that's an interesting way to look at life, and it's probably true. Yeah, you live longer too. Exactly, because seafood is absolutely the best. Absolutely. Okay, so uh, John, tell us um, about the restaurant, about the history. Uh, when did you start in this business? Well, TJ's has been in business 25 years. It was founded by a guy named Tom and a guy named Jim, thus TJ's. Uh, my family were customers the uh, first week that TJ's opened. And when Tom and Jim were ready to retire, my family uh, took over the business. They knew that we wouldn't screw it up since we had been customers for 10 years. And uh, now we've been in business 25 years. We've been named Dallas's best fish market and restaurant uh, last four years in a row by D Magazine. What a fantastic story. Tell me about the the, the, the fish, the way people can do. You can, you can either buy the fish out of the case or you will prepare it for them, is that correct? Absolutely, you can take uh, award-winning fish home with you to cook and all of our staff are culinary school trained uh, uh, experts who will tell you what to do. You can get that fish prepared and take it home or you can dine in with us as well. A moment ago, while I was waiting for you to come out and visit with us, I noticed that uh, one of your experts in cutting fish, is that is that the way you'd say it? Cutting fish? Mongering. Mongering fish, okay, was doing an unbelievable job and we happened to catch uh, a, a glimpse of it. What Do you know what he might have been working on? He was filleting a fresh Great Lakes walleye pike. Walleye pike is one of my favorite fish in the, in the uh, well here I'd say in the sea, it actually comes from the lake. Um, and we got that flown in directly from Minnesota and that is a wonderful fish. You know, it probably took him 10 minutes to fillet that fish, he was so meticulous. Is that is that the, the, the heart and soul that goes into the preparation here? Absolutely, you know, it's much easier for us to just bring in pre-filleted fish, but when we bring in whole fish and fillet them on site, you're getting a significantly fresher product because the air has not had a chance to degrade the fish's flesh. Tell us about your menu. Um, well, our menu is the fish case. It changes based on what seafood we have in that day. So yesterday, I had a different menu than I have today. Um, every single piece of fish in our case, you can uh, pick your fish and you pick one of seven ways you'd like it prepared. You can also have any piece of fish on a uh, entree salad, garden or Caesar salad. We have a great selection of little small plates. We have a uh, nice selection of tacos and sandwiches, appetizers, entrees, and then uh, you can also just get stuff steamed from the market like king crab legs, lobster, steamer clams, etc. And if, a, if someone wants to come in, have a nice glass of wine, relax, you can do that also? Absolutely. You know, what we've done is we've actually picked a wine list that's different than anybody else in town. What we've tried to do is we have tried to bring together the wines that people have been pairing with fish for hundreds of years. We always say, you know where to get your $300 cab, but you wouldn't be able to taste your fish. We have a really neat selection, and yes, reds too. Yes, you can drink red with fish. Um, we have... Uh, over 20 selections of wine that uh, are great pairs with seafood. John, when, when I travel around and I talk to various restaurants and various cafes, and one of the things that's always a mystery to me, and I'm sure it's a mystery to the other guests that are in the restaurant, is your fish in this restaurant, in this cafe, is your fish as fresh as a fish I could buy in Boston or New Orleans or maybe in Los Angeles? Absolutely. Uh, number one, the supply chain has gotten so sophisticated that what you see on the ice in Boston at 6 in the morning can be on the ice at 10 in the morning in Dallas, Texas. More fish flies through DFW Airport than any airport in America. We have access to the freshest seafood in the world. And what about uh, accenting the fish with a different spice or a different sauce? I noticed in the case it looks like you've got just a, a menagerie of, of sauces and uh, I've never quite seen anything like that in any fish shop. Well, what's really fun is that uh, at TJ's, the fish is the star of the plate. What you won't see is a bunch of uh, crazy techniques or filler. The fish is the star of the plate. And then we try to do the bare minimum we can to just give a little variety, whether that's a little wasabi vinaigrette drizzled over it or a little grilled corn and poblano. Um, it's a, a, our homemade blackening spice with a New Orleans Creole sauce. What we want is people to know is that they know how to cook more fish than they think they know. So the same thing you get here at TJ's, if you get the halibut Creole blackened, you can take, get that same blackening powder, that same Creole sauce to take home and replicate that dinner for your family. What a great idea. And it, as you say, I can take the fish home, 
I can make it almost as good as here, and I'm just as happy. Might even be better. <laughs> it might even be better. I don't know about that. I'm sure you cook better than I do. We're the only restaurant in town that will teach you how to cook every single thing on our menu. And tell me, before I leave, what are your hours? We are open 10 a.m. to 9 p.m. Monday through Saturday, and noon to 8.30 on Sundays. It's just been a pleasure to be here. Uh, the fish, the, the dishes that we've seen have just just melted in, in, in my mouth anyway. And uh, we look forward to coming back and seeing what else you're doing in the future. Uh, we appreciate your time and look, we would welcome anybody to come in. You think you can't get fresh seafood in Dallas? Let us show it you otherwise. Well, thank you so much.